Ooh. Ugh. Oh. Jeez. I'm here. <laughs> I'm here, everybody. I was running around. Like, well, not really. Not physically running around, but... Uh, it was a busy stream starting screen for me, my friends. Uh, very, very busy. Um, good morning. Good morning and happy Monday. Hope everyone had an enjoyable weekend. It's kind of hard to believe that it's already Monday. Feels not very fair, especially considering I have a work meeting starting. Um, and uh, <laughs> I'm a little miffed about that, if you couldn't tell. Um, I actually sent my boss a message um, on, I think it was, was it Wednesday or Thursday that we found out we were going to have it? And I was like, come on, really? And he's like, I know, I know, I'm not a fan of this because I'm going to have to be up late for like some other work. Um, you know, we do a lot of our our campaign changes um, near midnight. And so he's going to have to be up for that the previous day. Um, so Ursa, I know. Uh <laughs> Hello to you, Ursa, and you Monday meeting indeed. Um, we're probably just going to go ahead and jump pretty much right into it. Um, Coleman, congratulations on being first, my friend, and good morning to you. Hope you had a good weekend. Hope things were all well. Um, <clears throat> good morning, Ursa. <laughs> Did you have a good weekend? Things turn out all right? It was, um, I don't know, busy's not, I don't know, I don't think busy's really the right word. Um, but it was, uh, I, I don't know, I'm just tired this weekend. I was tired. Kept wanting to take naps. So, you worked, but it was good. I'm glad it was good, at least. Nothing, I mean, honestly, there's nothing wrong with working over the weekend. Um, provided it's, you know, it's enjoyable, especially. And if, assuming you're working all during the week, too. Because not everybody's on the same work schedule. But, uh, I mean, I, I tend to work on the weekends myself. Um... It's usually just a different type of work than my full time. Um, like I coach, I coach on Saturday mornings usually, and then uh, you know I'll work on some passion type projects, some uh, stream stuff, if you will. So, um, so yeah, uh, real fast, and then we're gonna get into the game. Um, I just released the schedule on Discord. Um, it's a bit of a busy week, if you will, uh, the exception being today. Today is uh, a short stream because I have a meeting that starts in about 47 minutes. Um, so I'm not even going to get to play too much of this, but I wanted to at least give myself a little more time with the Wandering Village. It's very good, um, but I just I haven't had a ton of time with it yet. Uh, tomorrow um, and potentially Friday, we'll see how how the, the schedule goes. But f tomorrow for sure uh, is a sponsored stream. Um, sponsored by Magic Spoon, so um, I'm excited for that. I've never I've never done this before. Um, I I'm, I've had sponsorship opportunities, but none of them uh, seemed like a good fit for me, and this one actually did. So I'm kind of excited just to see what it's like. But our server reset had issues, so I had to get the IT guy on it at 8 a.m. Saturday. I felt bad for bothering him, but I just needed an extra four hours to get a project done for today. Oh dang, your server reset. Our server reset and I had issues. So, huh, how did that happen? That's not, I mean, that does not sound good at all, Ursa. Um, so, so, so Tuesday will be a little bit of a different, a little bit of a different format, but, um, but we'll be uh, kind of be talking a little bit about Magic Spoon and then we'll be playing some Potion Permit. Uh, Wednesday, we'll get back into the Wandering Village, uh, so that I'll have a full, you know, two hours with the game. Uh, Thursday back into Potion Permits, so we're kind of just alternating those before we go back to Green Hell on Friday. And Friday could potentially be uh, the second of the sponsored streams, it, provided that things uh, work out uh, with the mail, essentially. So, Spidey Coots, what's going on, Koro? And Kira, hello to you too. It was a routine update when I logged on. Uh, logged in, I no longer saw the server. Oh, okay, I got you, I got you. Do you work? Um, do you work in an office when that happens, or like could somebody come by and take a look at it in person, or did you have to like call them, like a video meeting or anything? But, um, but yeah, the way the way that this this sponsorship thing is going to work is basically I'm going to show you guys. I'm going to talk a little bit about Magic Spoon, and then uh, we'll place an order, uh, and then assuming that order arrives uh, in time for Friday's stream. Uh, we'll do a little unboxing and kind of show you, uh, you'll get a legit 
uh, first impression from me, um, unfiltered, uncensored. So it'll be, uh, I'm, I'm looking forward to it. It's something that, um, that really caught my attention. And like I said, the other sponsorship opportunities I saw just didn't really fit like in terms of my interest and in terms of, um, uh, you know, the things that I kind of value in, in life, if you will. So <laughs> I don't know. That's kind of, that sounds way more dramatic than it really is, but you're 98% remote. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. Well, um, yeah, that is, hopefully that wasn't too bad. Hopefully that's not too bad. Usually it's just getting like a virtual drive added again, which isn't not usually too difficult. Are you on windows? Windows. I used to have to do that all the time when I worked in IT, uh, which is get people's get people's drives added back to their uh, to their system or get them added for the first time or whatever. Uh, it's not usually a complicated thing, though. So. Windows, but logging in my Office Mac. Oh, interesting. Poro, what's up? What's up, Lutz? How are you doing today? Hmm. Ooh, strong. I had the worst stomach bug of my entire life on Friday. Can you believe it? What? 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 A stomach bug on Friday? Oh, does that mean your whole weekend got ruined? That doesn't sound very fun. Ugh. I hate those kinds of things. I don't. I have. It's been a long time since I've had one, but I feel bad for you, Koro. Are you feeling better? Yeah, that's. That's a great question there, Ursa. Are you feeling better? Me and BB both got plagued the entire weekend. No. No. Oh, that's so frustrating. That's so frustrating. Um, well, hopefully you're feeling better. And, uh, gosh, that's, that's annoying. I know usually, like, if I ever whenever I get that, I, the, the worst part of those for me, I, I don't know if you had this as a symptom this time or not, but the, the shivers, that's the worst, the actual worst part of it for me is the shivers. Um, when those kinds of things come through, um, cause you end up like, I mean, they wake you up in the middle of the night, or at least they do for me. And then I'm like, I'm cold. So I try to wrap myself in a blanket, but then I'm sweating under the blanket. And so you've got that just dis discomfort of like, am I hot or am I cold? But then on top of that, you can't stop the shivering. And what it does is it causes your muscles to just tense up so much. You're so freaking sore. Um, and just then you're, you ache and it feels terrible, but morning to you, Charles. We're, uh, we're trying to send some good, good Healy vibes up to Cora, hoping that, uh, she's feeling better after a weekend of feeling like absolute garbage. So, uh, good Healy, feel good vibes to you, Koro. Spooky? Got to my desk. Morning, everyone. Morning to you, Spooky. Koro is ill. Uh, I, that's what we're trying to figure out. She was, she was sick all weekend. So we we're sending her some feel good vibes. Hopefully she's feeling a lot better today. Koro and Koro BB. There were moments when he was at the can and I was at the garbage can. We were just spewing away. Not in the sexy way. Wait a minute. <laughs> okay. Hang on a second. Is there a, there's a sexy way? Maybe I'm just not creative enough, but I'm struggling to think of a sexy way for that to go. Um, you know what? I think I, I think I regret asking though. So I think I regret asking. Let me, let me just rewind. <laughs> let me just rewind there. Um, I'm sorry that it was not in the sexy way that we all know, um, and do not in any way need explaining. Uh, <laughs> heard you had some gastroenteritis. I don't know. I don't know. How, I, I know what that word is, but I don't think, is that the correct way of spelling it? Anyway, I, I, I don't know the word well enough to correct you. So I'm just going to go with it. <laughs> Feeling better today. Thank the good Lord. Yeah, that is good to hear. That is really good to hear. Hope you're better. I'm rolling. <laughs> What's going on, Jersey? How have you been? How was your weekend? Hero Smexy's Spoida Boy. <laughs> that was kind of fun to say. <laughs> uh, I send you healing. Me as well. Me as well. Uh, friends, real quick. I uh, This is the last time I'll mention it for, for this portion of the stream. Uh, the schedule this week is a busy one. 
Um, so today we've got a shortened stream due to my 9 a.m. work meeting. Um, you can you can tell I'm fuming about it. Um, oh, well, I guess stream elements is a little early. That's what I was just about to talk about. Um, tomorrow we've got a sponsored stream sponsored by Magic Spoon. Um, so that link will work, um, but it's not really part of the campaign. I should probably turn that off, actually. Um, it's not actually part of the camp. It, the campaign is started, but uh, we're not officially streaming until tomorrow. So um, I should probably turn that off just to be safe. Don't want to don't want anybody to get mad at me. Um, so yeah, tomorrow we're going to be doing a sponsored stream by uh, sponsored by Magic Spoon. Um, and I don't want anybody to feel any pressure to support that. Um, for me, it was just a matter of uh, it was an actually like I've had other like sponsorship opportunities, but they just didn't do it for me. Like they were either something that I just had no interest in or just did not feel like I could support. But this one I was actually interested in. So um, so I was pretty I was pretty excited to see it. Uh, we're going to give it a shot just to see what just to see what a sponsorship's all about. Really, that's that's what I'm doing it for. Um, but I am, I'm pretty excited about it. And the other reason too, is they're giving me the opportunity to try the product alongside the campaign. I've never actually tried it myself, um, but they're going to be sending me some of it and, uh, so I'm excited for it. Um, so yeah, we're going to give it a shot, uh, see how it goes. So it'll be Tuesday and Friday, assuming that the, assuming that the, um, <laughs> assuming that the, uh, the shipment gets here in time for Friday's stream. So, but yeah. Um, is, it is the correct way to spell it. Took out eight people in one night uh, in our rental on a ski trip. Oh, gosh. What's a magic spoon, Papa? <laughs> a magic spoon. Uh, it's a uh, it's a healthier cereal. Well, it is a cereal. I was going to say alternative, but uh, it is a healthier, healthier cereal, um, protein packed cereal. I'm pretty excited to try it out. Actually, I'm, I'm really excited to try it out. Let me go ahead and turn this thing off for now. I mean, that that code will work. I just don't want... I just don't want to make the campaign mad at me if I'm promoting it without actually like branding the stream right now. So, um, so yeah. But that's gonna start tomorrow. Surprise, motherfucker! Waves magic spoon at Spooky. Poof! Now you're hungry. <laughs> Friday, oh man, that's very cool. I'm excited for it, Spooky. I'm excited. Um, it's, it's, it should be a cool opportunity, if nothing else, just to have a good learning experience. That's really all I'm looking for. That's really all I'm, all I'm hoping to get out of it. Anything above and beyond that is just bonus. You know, for me, I'm just, I'm just looking for the experience. So. Weekend was quiet. Took delivery of groceries from a new online supplier just now. Hospital and doctors Wednesday going out for lunch Thursday. Ooh. What's for lunch on Thursday? Tell me it's good or you might be joining. <laughs> Uh, it, it, sh it should hopefully be good, right? <laughs> you right? I mean, hopefully it's good. No, it should be. It should be good. Uh, I'm excited for it. It's um, I mean, again, I'm. It's this is not a sponsored stream here, but I'll just tell you the things I'm excited about is the fact that it's, it's like a high protein cereal with low sugar. That's the main thing for me because um, because when I'm in when I'm in training mode, um, limiting my sugars is really important to me. So, yeah. High protein, low carb cereal. I'm in. Nice, nice. Well, wait till tomorrow, Charles, if you if you can. I mean, if not, if you if you can't wait and you got to order it now, that's that's fine. Um, but it'll count for me tomorrow if you wait till tomorrow. So, but you're interested already, Ursa? <laughs> Hello to you, Coleman. Hello. Do you have to step away for some work duties? Duties. So yeah, that'll be tomorrow. I'm uh, I'm just I'm just uh, I'm just really curious to see what what kind of what it's gonna feel like, you know, to to gain the experience. Uh, that's all I'm in it for. Um, if it works out, awesome. If it doesn't, hey, you know what? We got some experience, so it's a win-win. We're gonna win either way. So yeah, indeed, I did. All good. All good. Well, hopefully, work's going okay. Hopefully, you had a good uh, good weekend too, Coleman. Um, friends, I've got about half an hour. I got about half an hour. Do um, you guys want to see how many people I can kill? I mean, uh, how good our village will be in uh, the Wandering Village? The birthday lunch at the cafe attached to a garden center. Oh, okay. The birthday lunch. Wait a minute. Hang on a second. Did I... I gotta check my calendar. I said I wasn't gonna add Jersey Griffin's birthday, but I had to make sure I... I feel like I'm missing another birthday that's pretty important. 
pretty important. Um, I think it's on the 28th, but I gotta make sure. Rewinding my calendar real quick. missing uh I think we're missing the great Hercules 78th birthday on the calendar. We sure are. We sure as heck are. I don't know why that is, but we are. Um I don't know I, I don't have the info enough to promote it because of the impending storm in the Gulf. Um but Kirk is planning on doing a a, a stream it's not a birthday stream, though. What what was the... I'm trying to figure out what this was for. I think it's just an extended stream. Um, extended stream that Kirk is doing uh, on Wednesday of this week. We're going to try to support that, but I don't know. It might get pushed back due to the storm. So, so yeah. Not a birthday stream. Birthday's, uh, birthday's in March. So, anyway... Uh, huge news about a Nintendo Switch. I've been no lifing potion permit. Oh, have you really? You got a Nintendo Switch? How is, uh, is, is, uh, is that the only game you've played on it so far? Uh, I don't normally eat sweetened cereals anymore, but those look really tasty. I, I think so too. I'm, I'm excited to give it a shot. People always, uh, come asking me where they're working at, even though I'm not part of figuring that all out. Well, you just look like you've got everything figured out, Coleman. I can speak from experience. You just look like you've got everything all figured out. You've been playing. I did see you on it, Coleman. I did see you on it. Um, they got a little Steam Steam notification saying you were online playing it. It's on Switch. It is. Yeah. Why does my boyfriend have the hardest friendship quest? I finally got the things to be able to complete it yesterday. Oh, dang. You are. You've blown past me then. I like to sweeten my cereal after so I know how much there is. That's a good. That's a good point. Jersey. Pirate Queen's first one is a grind, too. Dang, you guys are way past me. I wish I, uh... Man, I wish I had more time with this game. Ah. Finished Guardians of the Galaxy yesterday. I have to say it's the best game I've played since Horizon Zero Dawn. Really? Guardians of the Galaxy? It looks great. Um, just in terms of... I don't know. A lot of those superhero games look pretty, but they don't, um... They don't really play well. But that one looked like it was pretty and played well. So... Oh. Had to do uh, that a little at a time. Glad fishing doesn't take up energy. That's, yeah, that's a good point. Then potion permit. Mrs. Spooky and I played a ton of Overcooked. Nice. Zero mainline Nintendo games on this thing. Oh. <laughs> uh, we had heavy rain burst this morning, but that's, uh, that's what our weather is like. Fronts just sweep over us. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, there's a, there's a hurricane in the Gulf of Mexico here, uh, coming in, uh, in the United States. I think it's expected to make landfall... Wednesday or Thursday, I believe. Rabbit Hole runs deep in Potion Permit. There's a lot of content hidden there. I bet. Had a lot of time this weekend because all my friends were busy and couldn't play multiplayer games with me. Ah. Uh, still on our Dinkum run, but now I, I'm thinking I got to start Potion Permit. Oh, it's so good, Koro. It's so good. It's so dang good. Um, I'm going to go ahead and launch the Wandering Village. We don't have a lot of time with this game, so we might be able to get a couple days, maybe two days out of it. Um do in-game days, but it's just such a good game, and I'll try my absolute hardest to not kill anybody today, but I, let's be honest, that was not my fault. Let's, that was not my fault. People got on, people got, people got on our own boo, um, already poisoned, and like, I mean, they got on there before I ever had a doctor. My cousin Halifax still has no power from Hurricane Fiona. Oh, geez. Yeah, that's the thing. It's it's kind of... It's the second one coming through. Onbu evacuated its bowels. Okay. I gotta remember how to play this game. I got all these, uh, all these hints over here. Wait for kitchen research to finish. Construct a kitchen. What is this? That's the herbalist. Wish Dinkum was on Switch. It's not on Switch? I don't know why. That seems like a game that would be perfect for Switch, doesn't it? There's the kitchen. Okay, it is being finished. 
All right. So are those are the two buildings I'm uh, working on. What's this? Horn blower is not not built yet. Okay. I don't have any idle villagers. We're working on a pathway over here. We got some scavengers out. I think Spooky Deer is one of the scavengers. Hmm. Okay. There's the kitchen. Okay. Construct an herbalist. That's what's right here. Find plots here, herbalist. And then I have to grow the stuff. Herbalist is not constructed yet. Hopefully the builder will go over there. Choose my next research. I haven't picked up Dinkum yet because I was worried I'd run out of the release content too quick. Probably get it later on. Yeah, I don't think there's any big rush. Yeah, it is still pr uh, pretty early on. True. Hello there. Hello there, True Kelt. You've really enjoyed it. Yeah, and you've been killing it, Koro, from what I could tell. I know the Canadian Maritimes have one at the moment, but by the time they cross the Atlantic, they broadened. Hmm. Definitely makes sense. I don't have a ton of time on my hands right now, so I knew I'd be able to take it slow. Is anybody, is anybody interested in the Steam Steam Deck? I know it's it's like impo literally impossible to get one right now, but um, but I'm kind of wondering if I should if I should try to get one at some point. No release date for Dinkum on consoles yet. I don't think so. I haven't heard one. It's Prime Sub Day, True Kelt. Thank you so much for that, my friend. Cheers up to you. 16 months, my gosh. Absolutely mind blowing to me. How, how high some of these numbers have gotten in, in, in what feels like such a short amount of time. We've already known each other for at least 16 months. That's just mind blowing. True Kel, did you have a good weekend? I think one of my friends is getting a Steam Deck. So they're supposed to be restocking in October, I believe, right? Very curious about the Steam Deck, but I'd like to know more about its IRL battery life. That's a good point. That's a good point. I've heard not great things about it. Hmm. Feeding Trebuchet. Uh, can be used to launch food for Umbu to eat and decrease its hunger. So this is the one that's recommended. Uh, let's actually open the tree. Let's see here. Resources. Dung Collector. Use Biogas and Fertilizer. Um, food stand provides food for villagers in remote areas. I don't know how that works. Uh, warehouse we can use to store huts. Decontaminator. Hmm. Tomato plantation. Do all, all of these are taking longer to research now. I wonder why that is. Onbu, uh, let's see. It makes mushrooms into onbu food. Onbu food. That's kind of fun to say. You had an eventful weekend? Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Like, yeah, you can play God of War for it on it for seven minutes. Yeah, I think they... I think God of War was one of the ones I specifically saw that had short short uh, battery life. Yeah, all of these take six days. So all of our research is taking longer now. Maybe that's just a difficulty kind of modifier. The longer you play, the more difficult things get. Um, I kind of almost want like a different type of food. Require a lot of water. Plant and harvest wheat. Hmm. I feel like wheat would be good. I'm gonna, let's do wheat. Maybe that's stupid, but I want to try wheat. Horn blower needs to be constructed still. Herbalist needs constructed. Find plots. Construct an herbalist. Achieve at least 100% happiness. We're at 95% happiness? Really now? We can make berry muesli. We can make beet soup. Polenta. Huh. Okay. Beet soup, huh? We currently don't have anybody working uh, the kitchen, though. Interesting. Spend so much on iPads. Just want to bring out. Want them to bring out games for it. Yeah. I think I, at this point, it seems like your best bet is to is to stream a game using your iPad as a screen. How are we doing on this path here? We oh, we've got a toxic toxic forest coming up here soon. How did our uh, how did our scavengers do? Oh, they're not quite back yet. Okay. 
Okay, we need somebody to work the kitchen, though. We've got one builder, two carriers, five harvesters. Yeah, we ran out of materials. Oh, this herbalist is finished now. So I need somebody to man the herbalist hut. Uh, and also somebody to man the kitchen. We currently don't have enough people for all this stuff. Farming, um, they're just standing around, so I guess I need to plant. They're planting corn. Oh, no, they're going to plant beets. They're going to plant beets. Watch Conan's Clueless Gamer series while on my deathbed this weekend. It was hilarious. Clueless Gamer? Drove four hours round trip to pick up the retaining <clears throat> retaining brick walls we wanted. Spent hours move. Spent eight hours yesterday moving rock, hauling water, and shoveling path material. Dang, yeah. Probably uh, need some rest then, my friend. Dang, these are all... <clears throat> we're full on water, which I guess is a good thing. Uh-oh. Are we in the toxic cloud yet? Slightly poisonous air slightly increases toxicity. Crap. Is my dang doctor... The doctor is built, but we don't have any herbs because nobody's manning the herbalist hut. Okay, I gotta... I think I gotta take away one of the harvesters. And that puts somebody in there. Oh, no! Look at the toxic clouds! I'm just gonna try to keep the, the, the area small. Oh my gosh, it's hard to see? Oh crap. It's really hard to see. Who'd we hire? We hired Garv. Oh crap. Bart gas. <laughs> hey Peachy, how you doing? Good morning, Lutz and Chat. How you doing today, Peachy? Oh gosh, you gotta hurry up and make those herbs. We also I'm gonna have to find somebody to be a doctor. Let me go ahead and reduce that worker. We'll hire this worker. Uh do I take a harvester? I think I got to take a harvester. So we're going to be hiring somebody here. Right? Wait a minute. Where'd that worker go? Spawns poisonous plants on Unbu's back? Wait, really? Oh, crap. How did the... Okay, they brought back 20 bread. Oh, crap. Every time they do this, everybody wants to go to the scavenging place to get the bread, and it ends up taking a lot of time. Can be incinerated or harvested. I don't know how that works. Okay. We're a little bit... Oh, is the poison gone now? Oh, we're already through it. Holy cow. I'm gonna move fast. Green gas equals toots magoots, baby. <laughs> May I recommend streaming Game Pass? It is really good. If you can do xCloud, it's very good. I've had pretty good... Uh... Oh, wait, is Peachy... Peachy's a researcher now? I think... Oh, that's probably what happened. We got an extra researcher. Wait. No, never mind. Is Peachy... Oh, Peachy's the village doctor. Peachy, you're the village doctor. So we did get somebody to, uh, hired then. These herbs only take one, one water. Oh crap, how did... Destroy all poisonous plants, there are 13. Poisonous plants that start growing on Unbu, if not dealt with quickly, they will spread, infecting plants and poisoning villagers who go near them. Removing all poisonous plants from Unbu's back using the harvest tool or decontaminator building. Oh, son of a gun, all right. I got to get those babies gone. Oh, dang, they're killing my trees. Is this thing laying down? I think he is. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, this is terrible. I, How do I increase? I got to increase the priority on him.
Oh, son of a gun. Yeah, we're already up to 18 plants. Oh, frick. You guys, this could get really bad. Because I just had to... I had to get rid of some of my... Uh, harvesters, too. All right. Is the village doctor ready yet? Why is nothing happening over here? Garve. Okay, Garve is trying, I guess. Very slow. Uh, I started a show called Reboot this weekend. It was very sad to find out only three episodes are out so far. Death thought it was an older show, so I got a rude awakening when I finished the third. Oh, dang. I heard good things about that show. I'll add it to my list. We binged the Imperfects yesterday. It was very good. 18 to 20 something year olds with superpowers because of some genetic testing they participate in. I think I saw that's all. Is that Netflix? I think I saw something about that. Geechee, I think you're going to have to. Oh, crap. I think you're going to have to work at the herbal hut first. Yep. Yeah. You're going to have to work at the herbalist hut first before we can. Uh, we can get you uh, to be the doctor. Because we just don't have enough stuff. Are we getting rid of any of these plants? No. Why Why aren't we? Where are the harvesters at? Yeah, I, I don't know. So I've, I, I've not learned the mechanics of this game yet, apparently. Is that one? Yeah. My gosh, it's spreading badly. It's really bad, you guys. It's really bad. We're up to 25 plants now. And I can't get them to... I don't, I don't know why I just can't get anybody to do anything. I just can't. Um, I need to find some more. So there's iron ore there. Wood or mushrooms can be found here. Hmm. We'll try to send out our scavenging party. This actually pause the game. I think it does. Hey, Lady Iron. Hi, hi. We got COVID as a lovely souvenir. No. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Lady Iron. Hopefully, uh, hopefully it goes away without too much trouble. Herbs. <laughs> fart gas. Oh, yeah. Love how fart gas came up before morning, Peachy. <laughs> Green gas. Oh, wait. Shoot. Today I learned don't spread out your town. Yeah, that's that must be part of my problem. Do you all trust Peachy as the doc? As much as anybody else, I'd say. Oh, no. I'm sorry, villagers. I'm not trained to be a doctor. I've only seen a handful of seasons of Grey's Anatomy. <laughs> More versed in the medical world, world of scrubs. Well, you... You are the most qualified, then, I would say. I've seen no Grey's Anatomy. I've seen a decent amount of scrubs, but no Grey's Anatomy whatsoever. Um, yeah, I do need to get some food here. Where else do we have people working? We have three farmers. Um, people are carrying stuff over there. Yeah, the thing that I've not figured out, Charles, is the transport. Um, I built roads, but I don't understand how they choose where to store things. Um, I've not figured that part out. Um, yeah, it's very strange. Very strange. I think I'm going to need to get some... I might need to take some carriers out. Make them harvesters. But then again, nothing's like this. This thing isn't going to get done. I can see who the carriers are, I suppose. Moving to water tank. Charles, you're one of the carriers. You're carrying water to the water tank. That's not really necessary, though. Not super necessary. Our builder is Blackstaff. Been building uh, building the dirt road. Not doing a very good job of it. None of it is done. Okay. And harvesters. Uh, Decimus is working on one of the poison plants. Okay. That's good. Why didn't you just get the poison plant that's right? In I don't. I don't understand what's going on here. 
Yeah, I think I think we're gonna die. I think everybody's gonna die. This is good. I trust any of us except for Koro since she was just sick. <laughs> Scrubs is the best, bro. It was for real the worst stomach bug I've ever had. That sounds awful. Sounds really awful. Wait a minute. Why are you guys just standing here? Oh, you don't have any water. Russell. So we have Peachy. Who's this? Is that Charles? Russell is... I wish you could see their occupation from here. It just says they're a worker post. But I guess they are, in fact, a carrier. So it's, it's just a means of clicking... A few things here okay yeah i gotta i gotta take some i gotta take these carriers down and put them in the uh, harvester hut although i think somebody else just went to the kitchen yeah russell's gonna be a kitchen worker that's actually not so bad we're all gonna die time to panic <laughs> iron no Yeah, Miss, I mean, Mrs. Magoots ended up healing up pretty well from it. I hope you do as well, Lady Iron and uh, Lord Iron. Did he Did he get my birthday wish, at least? There's suspicious lack of accountants in both series, given they're, uh, they're in the U.S. The accountants. Ombu's getting pretty hungry. Hmm. Do I have a way of feeding Ombu? Well, there's a mushroom right up there. Okay. But the problem is I'm ne I'm never going to finish this dang horn blower. Cuz I don't know what I don't know what Blackstaff is doing. Um He's eating, I guess. Moving to dirt road. Yeah, he keeps eating all the way up there. Yeah, that's the problem is the food situation. So, he is not even done. Oh, he's done one thing. Okay. Let's figure that out. You're no longer a builder, Blackstaff. Uh, well, actually, we can make you a builder potentially with this being higher priority. What if I do that? Moving to dirt road. Uh, okay, maybe I need to make you a carrier. Carrier first. Oh, my workers are poisoned now? Oh, freaking great. Freaking great. Yeah, we're dying. We're gonna die. I don't know why that made me laugh so hard. I played it for him, yes? He said, aw, thanks, Lutz. Yes! Mission accomplished. Well, aside from possibly feeling awful um, on his birthday, I hope it was a good day. Hope it was a good day. The people should be getting muesli from there, huh? Let's see. This person is. Yeah. Okay. That's good. Scavenging party brought back five iron ore. Okay. That's good. That's good. And we, we can send them out for stones and other minerals. I think I'm going to send them into one of these forest areas. Because we could get some mushrooms. I just don't know how I'm going to feed the onbu yet. I think I need the trebuchet for that, but I don't remember what I didn't research that, so that's part of the part of the problem. Hopefully he goes the, the way of the mushrooms. Um because if not, we're we're definitely dead. Which I mean we'll probably die next time. I don't want to die, Mr. Lutz. <laughs> Stop. Stop it. We're getting people poisoned though, because this this poison cloud we went through is just decimating this area. But I have to I have to send them through They're moving to the kitchen. Yeah. Well, at least we learned what to do better for the next time. Because yeah, this is I, I think I spread things out too much. We didn't build roads early on enough. Um, and I just can't get my worker balance figured out. Like I just for the life of me, this has the highest priority of building. But for the life of me, I cannot get I cannot get somebody to go just carry the materials over here. I, I, I can't. I just can't. Oh, we also don't have any... Pl Wait, we don't have a carpenter. Maybe that's why that's a problem. We should have wood planks or wood... Oh, yeah, we definitely do. So then instead of being a carrier, let's make you a carpenter. 
Charles, you're now a carpenter, but I think you're also poisoned. Yes, you are. You're definitely gonna die. Uh, cause I can't get I can't get any of these herbs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. So we we have enough for almost two people. I think it takes fifteen fifteen herbs to freaking to heal somebody. I think this run is doomed. I think it's doomed. Do we just restart? I mean, I don't have very much time left to play anyway, but I think I think I can just give up on this playthrough. I don't think there's any way I'm going to be able to salvage this. We're at 78 poison plants. We have not destroyed a single one yet. Oh, well, actually, maybe we did, but... I'm curious to see how many... Maybe these are worth three each. If so, then we have a chance of, of healing people. We do have a chance. Let's see here. Peachy, move into the kitchen. Garb is collecting collecting some herbs. How many are you going to carry, Garv? No, there's only one each. Yeah, I mean, it's just not... See, when we harvest, like, beets. Beets are worth three. They collect three beets every time they, they harvest. Uh, so that makes it doable. But this is one herb each time. One herb? Is this also green hell? I think it is. I, I think it is. Oh, Onbu cursed us all. They cursed us all. Well, we tried. <laughs> we tried. <laughs> Uh, we got the positive on his birthday, so that was not a fun gift. But his mom dropped off some German chocolate cake, so that was nice. Ooh, you could taste it, I hope. German chocolate cake is pretty dang good. Not my work husband. Can you fail a run outright? You sure can, yeah. Either the Ombu dies or all of your villagers die. Uh, that is a way to fail. I mean, you'll eventually fail in this game. Um, it's a survival game, so eventually you will lose. Basically, I think it's trying to get as far as you can. I think maybe maybe there's a maybe there's an end game. I was under the impression that basically you just you play until you can't anymore. But, all right, boys, he's feeling lucky. <laughs> but always know I appreciate you. <laughs> went from being a doctor to being in the kitchen. You went from being a doctor to being one of the um, herbalist collectors. I had to get the I had to get the items collected. I'll try to... We'll try to go ahead and make you a uh, a doctor now. But it's all random. Yeah, so you're being you're going to be the village doctor. The thing is, you've got fi 15. So really, we need, we need carriers, I think. That's the thing. How do the carriers know? How do the carriers know what needs to go over there? Charles is moving to the pile of beets. Just eating the beets right off the ground. Yeah, this is a uh, this is doomed. Well, <laughs> I think we're gonna start a new run uh, on Wednesday, my friends. Do you walk around the poison cloud? No, unfortunately. Um, so you see it right here. It's it's you, you're forced to kind of go through it. Forced to go through it. Um, so yeah, it, and and we'd be especially doomed if the onbu turned right here instead of going straight because he's pretty hungry. Yeah. Or wait, is 25% how much food he's got remaining? Or I don't know. Yeah, I just can't get people to do what they need to do. I think I, I think I expanded too quickly is the problem. We dug too fast. We dug too deep too fast. The kitchen was a great idea. The kitchen's kind of killing it right now. So I think I need to make a kitchen sooner. Um, is happiness? Uh, how do I see what ha- I, I guess we got 100% happiness somehow. Even though we're- We're dying of poison. Um. We somehow got 100% happiness. 
no idea how that's possible. But yeah, friends, I think I think that this is um I think we can just uh we can just go ahead and take the L here. I think we can go ahead and take the L. Um so let's go ahead and go to the menu. We're gonna take the L here. That is a that is a death. Um that's a death. Much more wholesome version of Green Hell? Absolutely. It, I've heard it's a tough... I had heard it was a tough game. Um, but now I know just how tough. So, yeah, Wednesday we'll start a new run. Um, unfortunately, it is a short day today. Um, we've got... I've got a morning meeting starting here. Very not happy about it. Let's head to the tavern. Yeah, spooky. A 9 a.m. meeting on a freaking Monday, dude. I'm like, just, I'm triggered. I'm triggered. Triggered, triggered, triggered. Uh, but yeah, you can't, con I can't control uh, where they walk. Um, so yeah, I think they just kind of go wherever they, like the shortest path, essentially. We Luce was saying he was going to send Ombu to the woods. Sounded like you had some control. Oh, no, I sent a scavenging party out to the woods. The sick can't vote. <laughs> Horrible way to start your Monday yet. Yeah, quit? <laughs> Potentially? Why can't the sick vote? You have a 9 a.m. meeting every Monday? Oh, dang. Yeah, that's just not really... That's not That's not our typical work, work culture. Um, It's sort of customary to not have meetings start until 10 a.m. So, love you. Love you too, Lady Aaron. Hopefully you feel better soon. Uh, let me go out some thank yous and one more uh, one more mention about this week's stream because it's a, it's a busy one. Uh, Coleman, thanks for being our mod today. Oh, and Stream Elements is going to show up on that, too. I forgot about that. Uh, True Kelt for the resub. Thank you so much, my friend. And our Kofi members, Bookpunk, Coleman, Iron, Phil, Fresh, Curry, Nidalicious, Peachy, Oak. and Spooky. Thank you all so much for the support. Uh, real quick, I got to run through this, the schedule again for this week. Tomorrow is a sponsored stream, sponsored by Magic Spoon. Um, we're going to be playing Potion Permit. I'm also going to be placing an order for the Magic Spoon cereal. Um, and then hopefully it'll be here Friday in time to do the unboxing and taste test of the uh, the cereal. We're doing that live on stream, so you'll get my real reaction from it. Uh, I've never had it before, um, but that's kind of the reason why I took this opportunity is because it's something I'm really interested in, um, and it's it's a way to try it out, but also see what sponsorship life is like, if you will, just to gain some experience. So uh, don't feel pressured to support uh, to like to purchase or anything like that. Um, if you want to, that's awesome, but but don't feel any pressure to do that. It's it's more so just a, a, something I wanted to gain some experience in. So, so yeah, uh, that's tomorrow with Potion Permit. Wednesday, we'll be back into the Wandering Village. Um, and then uh, Thursday is uh, is back into Potion Permit again. Friday and... What am I leaving off? Wednesday. Also, drop on a YouTube video on Wednesday. So be ready, be ready, be ready for that. All right. It's going to be awesome, I think. I hope. Uh, it seems like it. Um, and then Thursday, Potion Permit, Friday, Green Hell. So that's the week. Uh, Friday uh, will be hopefully stream two of the sponsored series. Um, otherwise, it'll continue into next week. So, yeah. Team Magic Spoon Cereal, always, want to know how, always wanted to know how it tastes. I, I also want to know how it tastes. I'm excited for it. So don't eat before stream. I will not, Jersey. I will not. Don't worry. Excited for your Potion Permit gameplay? Oh, shoot. I'm falling behind you guys, though. Falling behind. Thanks so much for hanging out with us, Ursa. 9.30, stand up for you every day, Charles. Man. Uh, my wife would eat cereal every night for dinner before she had someone to cook for her. Uh, honestly, cereal is kind of one of the things that Mrs. Magoots have eaten as dessert uh, in the past. Like, kind of after dinner. So. Have a wonderful Monday, everyone. You as well, Peachy. Thank you all so much. I gotta run. This meeting is starting right meow. Um, I... I will see you tomorrow. I'm I'm triggered. I can't hang out with you more today, but thanks so much for your support today. Uh, and as always, I love y'all. Uh, take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you real soon. Bye. No, oh, they are criminals. They know it. They know what they're doing. <laughs> All right, goodbye, everybody.